again in my car we had an off day so I don't really know what to do um, I just got done eating breakfast and I guess I'm gonna try to go run some errands I don't really feel like being in the hotel all day so I'm trying to keep myself busy but um, yeah so we'll see where the day takes me Museum of Natural Sciences um, downtown. That was pretty fun. Um, never been to a museum alone, so that was a new experience. And then went and got some lunch. Just again, trying to take up some time during the day on this off day. And now, probably just gonna chill till tomorrow morning, till we have training. Um, I actually don't have any roommates anymore. I have the room to myself. My roommate got basically a new, another opportunity with another team somewhere else. So, yeah. And I think I was probably more shocked and like mind blown than she was because like you're here for a week and then all of a sudden like a new opportunity comes and like you're basically like shipped off somewhere else and that's like no really not a lot of time to like prepare for that and I just think that's pretty wild and, uh, yeah I I mean obviously it can happen like you can just be in one place and the next day someone else calls you and you need to be there not knowing what's gonna happen next is it's a little like a little stressful but it's also exciting because it's like a new opportunity, new experience, and like nothing can come bad from any of this, which I'm starting to realize. So, the hotel life. So yeah, I have the room to myself and it's like, I don't want to be in here all day, but what else am I gonna do? Cause I also need a rest. I'm okay with being by myself. And I think like, over the years, I've gone okay with like going places by myself and like, especially now in the past week, I've like had more meals by myself than I ever had before. But, um, so I think it'll be like a good lesson to like be able to like sit with myself, be okay with who I am and like reflect, learn things, but I don't know. But yeah, so week one was tough, um, really hard, but I survived, I'm alive, and I'm healthy, and that's all I can ask for. Um, but I know it'll probably only get harder and just will only test me even more. But yeah, I had a pretty good first week. I'm happy with um, how I've been playing and like getting to know some of the girls are all super nice. Um, yeah, I think I've like consistently been able to walk off the field and feel like I don't have any regrets playing which I think is huge because I hate like leaving a training session or like a game like feeling like I could have done something or but I've been like okay with walking off the field with my performance so week two starts tomorrow and I just gotta keep doing my thing back to the grind and just hopefully just like progress every single day even if it's like small victories just like completing more passes or like cutting off more passes or more tackles whatever just like something that I can track so I know that like I'm on the right path and um yeah just keep enjoying myself keep having fun but yeah thank you guys for watching and I would say all those things youtubers say at the end but it kind of makes me cringe so I'm not you know what to do after you watch a video so yeah
Bye. 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 Bye.